Brandy Cross. Last night they did this. Found her car's window busted Friday morning for the second time in less than a month. Who can afford to continue to get their window fixed every day? You know, I'm outdone. And it's like, you know, we work hard for our stuff and this is what happens. As she surveyed her own damage, she saw more glass and more missing windows and then noticed car after car along 65th Street and beyond hit. On this block, it was four cars. And then on that very next block, it's about six cars. Johnny Wilkes had his, his wife's and his daughter's car parked on the street overnight. So you have three cars in total. Three cars in total right now that I got to go get fixed right now. Those in the neighborhood say they didn't hear or see anything, but believe the people responsible for doing this were working in a group. None of the alarm systems are going off. So they're busting through the windows and climbing through the window to ransack the cars. So I, I, I guarantee it's probably two or three people. The victims say the vandals did not get away with much, just their patience. You're just dumb. You're dumb. You're not going to get anything out of it. You're just going to ruin your life. I know you got to be some kids. You got to be some kids. I'm mad. It's bummy. We too old for that. I'll go get some jobs or some y'all breaking in cars at the end of the middle of the night. That's bummy. In Milwaukee, Hannah Hillier, WYSN 12 News. Now, the victim did tell 12 News that they did contact police. Wilkes says it will cost up to $700 to get those three windows fixed.